Alrighty, hey guys, what is going on? My name's been a hot minute since we've done something like this. Got an extra paycheck, so I decided that I would go ahead and spend it. Awesome gym shark clothing to show you guys. So, that is exactly what we're gonna be doing. Welcome to Gym Shark Hall. I believe this is what, number four now? We've done four of these. This is some of the new stuff. This has uh, got a few things from the Ease collection in here and then a few new items that uh, we haven't seen before. So, let's go ahead and crack this baby open and try some of it on. We'll see how it all fits. I did get something that's a little different. They're flex like I don't know how I'm gonna feel about them, but we'll find out. Don't worry, I plan on wearing pants over them. All right, so first up on the list, you guys know it. Um, I'm a really big fan uh, of Snapback Hat. And you guys know that uh, I've, I've been wanting one of these for a long time. Gymshark hasn't had these in a God knows how long. So this is uh, my first ever uh, is it Gymshark Snapback. I forgot to do Gymshark, I forget all the time how great Gymshark's packaging is, and it's actually legit. So here it is, we got the, the Gymshark uh, gray snapback. Um, I'm digging this color. It's actually more of like a, like a shirt material. So here's my here's my Call of Duty World War II snapback. And you can kind of see the, the texture on it. It's more of a, like a rough and like rugged type of texture. I don't know how to describe texture, okay? But this one's soft, like it's a soft texture. We got the rubbery Gymshark logo on the front there. Thing off, all during the summer I wore, wore snapbacks all the time. Like every time I went out or I went to the pool or something, I would throw on a snapback, big good to go. But uh, what I really wanted was a Gymshark one because I wore everything else Gymshark. So why not have a, 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 a hat of it? So now we're, we're good, we're set, we're ready to go. I'm definitely not gonna wear it like that all the time. It's in light gray model for anyone who, who is one of these. You guys know I try to read the tag. Next up, we're gonna be talking about uh, one of the uh, other Apollo V2 shirts. If you guys don't know what the Apollo shirts are, they are, I don't have one with me, but it's like the white Gymshark one, with the Gymshark logo across the front. You guys can see it in, in, in the bag here. But we'll go ahead, we'll get it undone. Two the packaging just always makes me happy. All right, so here it is. This is in the the nightshade purple, nightshade purple. I'll go ahead and throw, I'm gonna throw all of them on like I normally do. All right, so this one is going to be the uh, the Apollo V2 T-shirt. This is in the nightshade purple. As you can see, it's kind of a darkish, uh, purplish color. Got the Jim Shark logo right there across the front. These ones are actually my favorite because they're just like regular t-shirts, like completely regular t-shirts. The next two are actually from the brand new uh, Ease collection. It, it's kind of, uh, I'm gonna call it the do it with Ease collection if you guys will, um, Ease. So you need some clothing to do that with. So these are more longer like anytime style t-shirts. They have a uh, Gymshark logo down here in the bottom right, if you guys can see that. And it's just little tiny Gymshark. It's just basically like a, like a regular white t-shirt, but it's a lot, it's a little bit longer than their standard t-shirts. And on top of that, it's made to uh, like be whatever, a whatever type of t-shirt. It has a little bit of a different, different bottom to it. It kind of rolls up at the bottom, not really staying perfectly straight, but it just kind of rolls up. Kind of cool, it's a neat little, neat little concept. It's a lot different than some of the normal like gym t-shirts that they actually have. Oh yeah, dude, either. This is comfortable. This is actually really cool. So it has, the sleeves are kind of rolled up. They're not really like hemmed like this one is. So if you look at the sleeves on, so like as you guys can see here, the the sleeves are more hemmed on, on this one, on this style, as opposed to the style that's on this this one, where it's kind of like, it's not even hemmed. It's just kind of more like sitting there in a, in, in a sense. So uh, I really like these. These are, these are actually really comfortable. I'm digging this one. So I also got this, I got the white one, and I have another one that's in pink. So now here is that pink one. And the pink one, I'm, I'm digging too. I think they just look, I don't know, I just think they look really, really cool um, with the, the sleeve here. And they just seem more like a, a relaxed fit t-shirt as opposed to like the nightshade polo. They're not, the Apollo V2 shirts are more of a loose fitting shirt as opposed to these shirts, which are a little bit more tight and uh, form fitting. Um, not as bad as like this one was. These shirts, these, uh, the old school like form t-shirts, these ones are actually very, very tight fitting. So there's a difference. Like the Apollo, much more loose fit or a much more loose fit anytime wear shirt. This one, the E shirts, 
shirts are very much more form-fitting uh, anytime shirt and these ones are just a, a basically like gym form-fitting shirt it feels almost like a like a compression shirt but in a t-shirt material so uh, let's go ahead I'm gonna drop the camera down the waist area because that's the only way you guys are gonna be able to see these and I'm gonna try on the the two new pairs of shorts that we got there the arc shorts so these are Gymshark's fit taper bottoms there um, if you guys can see that kind of in the light it's right there the Gymshark logo is but uh, I've had a pair of gray ones now I have a pair of black ones uh, I've had a pair of gray purple and black taper down but these are actually a different style of taper the taper is different it doesn't bulge out as much it actually stays you know kind of in line with the fabric here where the fabric separates for the taper and then same with this side it kind of does the same thing this one's a lot easier to open as opposed to the left one but you get your drawstrings here in the front there, there are no back pockets on these so that is one difference between so that's like one difference between the other fit taper bottoms that I have these are like the newer version the other tip fit taper bottoms actually have pockets in the back of them like back pockets for like my wallet and stuff which I really like that style more because it gives me more of like a I, I guess I would say jean sweatpant feel because I can put my wallet back there so these are the brand new art shorts and a charcoal model we get the gym shark logo there we got two front pockets and then you have one back pocket this back pocket is actually a uh, this is like actually a tapered back pocket so I can throw my wallet in here and then zip it back up so it doesn't fall out or anything or if I want to put my phone back here or something so it doesn't fall out or anything like that and I've never really been a big fan of shorts that come above my knees like I'm not I'm not like that. One thing to make note of, these sweatshorts don't really fit well with like very loose boxers. If you're gonna get some, get the Gymshark, um, like boxer, boxer briefs, any like that. But Gymsharks are definitely probably the most comfortable boxer briefs I've ever worn. And I'm not just saying that, I'm dead serious. Like I've worn Calvin Klein, Michael Ford, I've worn American Eagle, Air Apostle. Dude, I've, I've worn it all trying to find the best pair of boxer briefs and by far the Gymshark or Calvin Klein has to be the top one or two. But moving on, we've got the, the Gymshark light gray model uh, sweat shorts, the ARC sweat shorts. Like I said, one more time, we got the Gymshark here. We got the, the taper pocket right there on the right gluteus maximus. And then that's pretty much it for this one. I'm actually gonna go ahead and uh, I'm gonna go ahead and throw on what's supposed to go under here. And uh, we'll see, we'll see kind of how I like it. Um, I gotta take my socks off. I had to change underwear for, for this, guys. Like, that's how dedicated I am to, to this video. I changed underwear. Yeah, let's go ahead and get right to it. All right, so what you guys know is the worldwide phenomenon for women from Gymshark. The one thing that they're known for, for women, is their flex leggings. Now, officially bought my hair off leggings, like men's leggings. Like, I've had friends that have purchased them before. Don't sit there, and if you're watching this and you're a gym, gym fanatic like me, or you play a bunch of basketball and things like that, don't think that you've never once in your life thought, hmm, I wonder why women think that the uh, leggings are so damn comfortable. Well, your boy's about to find out. I'm actually about to put these on and find out just how um, amazing leggings actually are. I sound so stupid saying that. How do you women do this? This is actually thoroughly impressive. Oh my god. God. No women are still why it took forever to get. Bro, these are actually hella comfortable. Not gonna lie. Yo, these are legit. Now I understand why like people actually like. Yes! Look at that shit. Look, dude, I got flex leggings on for dudes. Like, you women are not the only ones who get to experience flex leggings. Like, these are legit. I'm digging these. Anyways, I think that's going to do it for the video. That was pretty much all I had from this Gymshark haul uh, number four. I had the two pairs of art shorts, the flex leggings, and I'm currently still wearing them. I need to eh, take off. I'm gonna go to bed. I've got the Fit Taper Bottoms in black. Got the Apollo V2 shirt in nightshade purple, uh, which is a color that I hadn't seen before, which is originally why I picked it up. And then you got the Salmon, the light pink one, uh, the E shirt that I'm wearing, and then the white E shirt that uh, is over there on the table. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching the video. If you guys would like to see more of these, definitely drop a like down below and comment what you guys would like to see a purchase. Next up is coming winter. So maybe we'll do like a winter episode um, before too long with uh, some of the new sweatpants they have and a few other things. But uh, anyways, thank you guys so much for watching the video. If you did enjoy it, please be sure to smash the thumbs up button. Thumbs up button, thumbs up button and subscribe if you're new to the channel. And remember to turn on post notifications so you know when a new video goes live. And as always, your life be infinite. I'll talk to you guys later. Boom!